What's up, everyone? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> I got you. Hey everyone, it's the week 21 pregnancy vlog. This week the baby is the size of a carrot. Quite large. How many inches was that? Ten and a half inches. And last time we got measured at the ultrasound, we found out the baby's a pound. So it's probably over a little over a pound now. Alright, <laughs> so what's been going on this week? You had your doctor's appointment on Thursday? Yep. And I went back to work, and the kids went back to school, so mm -hmm. that's kind of what's been going on. How'd the doctor appointment go? Doctor appointment went good. He answered all my questions. I think we had some questions about um, snoring. Nothing we can do about that. <laughs> Sorry, hon. <laughs> More on that later. <laughs> We're doing a follow-up uh, urine culture to see how um, the strep B is doing. I don't have the results yet, so we'll probably update you in the next video. Hopefully, um, better and better for that. Oh, we were hoping to have a due date, or like a scheduled C-section date, but we don't. But it sounds like in the next week or two, they'll call, the scheduling center will call, and we will set a date. So probably about a week before August 12th. Sure. Yeah, kind of bummed. Maybe. Thought we would have a birthday set after this appointment so I could ask for the time off work and get everything ready to go, but yes, it'll be a little bit longer. How much time are you going to take off? I think I, I believe I get six weeks and then two weeks within the first year you can take off for bonding time. Mm -hmm. And they did change it at my work. It used to be based on how long you'd been there what percentage you'd get paid and now it's all 80 percent no matter what I, I think you still have to be there like a year um mm -hmm. but kind of bummed about that because i've been there long enough the last kids we had i was at 100 percent yeah then so i would have still been at 100 percent, but now it's 80 no matter what so we'll have to trim down our budget when we have one more kid for a few weeks or a few months <laughs> yeah good luck with that right yeah <laughs> But 80% is still better than not getting any time off. And yes. So, can't really complain. So that was the doctor's appointment. What else has been going on? I guess we'll come back to the snoring because... No, oh, you want to talk about that. snoring has been, like, so ridiculous. <laughs> like, one night when the girls were spending the night at someone else's house, <laughs> I slept in the other room because I couldn't... Yeah, it was like... I it was three in the morning the and then I woke up and I was like... Michael's not in bed, and then I found him in the girl's bed. <laughs> I just, I can't even do it anymore. It used to be I could, if I could fall asleep before Hilda, then everything <laughs> would be good. But, like, she falls asleep within, like, two minutes after we stop talking. It's, like, instant sleep, and then it's instant snoring. There's no, like, <laughs> little bit, and then gets a little worse, and then gets a little worse. No, it's, And like, it wakes me up sometimes, full too. Full on, oh, yeah. <laughs> after, like, a 20 or 30 minutes, she'll, like, wake up, and I'm, like, laughing. You woke yourself up from snoring. <laughs> it's so bad, though. It's, like, yeah. I, yep. It's been hard to fall asleep. Poor Michael. <laughs> I need my beauty sleep. The other big symptom I've had is being tired a lot. <laughs> Again. Um, yeah. So I think the last week has uh, been hard because we had a week off of school and work and then the week back. Yeah, so you definitely seem to have been more tired this week. Um, taking yeah, one day. Again and... Like on the day I had the doctor's appointment, I got the girls off to school, then I took a nap until like 11 o'clock. And then I jumped in the shower and left at 11.15. And then I went to my appointment and I came home and I took a nap until I had to pick up the girls from school. <laughs> and yeah, I was just completely exhausted and then I felt like I could take like a third nap. Or did I take a third nap? I don't know. It's hard to remember. I don't but yeah, super tired. And it seems like you were having heartburn problems too. Oh, yes. Again. So that sucks. I know. Can't really take anything for it. Mm hmm So, definitely yeah. triggered by foods we eat. Like, we had Tomato the, sauce is bad. Yeah, you know, we had the spaghetti sauce dinner, and that triggered it. And mm hmm Fried foods are bad, and all sorts of stuff are bad. Yeah. Everything's <laughs> bad. I guess one other thing we could talk about is, uh, last night, I would wake up in the middle of the night, and my 
like my hand was completely asleep and it was like the two, the middle finger and the ring finger, um, completely asleep and it kind of shoots up and I remember having carpal tunnel with the girls and when I woke up this morning it would kind of go away but the tips of my fingers kept feeling numb so I don't know if I need like a, a brace on my arm or my wrist so I can wake up and feel okay if you have any recommendations on pregnancy carpal tunnel let me know because yeah, you really haven't fun. had it until now, right? <laughs> yeah, it was my first time last night. So. And I kind of remember last time I got it more like week 30 plus. So this seems a little early mm -hmm. for it. So we're past the halfway point, and Yay. I think it's time to look at the belly. Week 21. Okay. Belly shot. It looks huge. It's Super huge, it right? It is looking bigger now. Even the belly button looks like huge through the shirt. <laughs> Bam! <laughs> you know, it's like Emily's teacher said I can't hide the baby anymore. Like it's super obvious. <laughs> or it was Zoe's teacher. I mean. Yep. So there's the belly. Okay. So that's it. There it is. I think that's about all we got. So we didn't schedule mm -hmm. the birth like we were hoping, but maybe in the next two weeks we'll have a date for you. And uh, we're still struggling with the name. Yeah, still Baby's struggling named. with the name. Emily's got her preferred name down. But yes. we're try it's not bad, but we're trying to think of <laughs> other options. And then Michael did come up with one name, but we're still kind of dreaming about it. Or yeah, just thinking about it. Yeah. So any name suggestions, put them down in the comments below. We could definitely use them. Mm-hmm. And as always, if you want to catch up on all our baby videos, just click the link up here. I'll put a link to the whole playlist, and you can watch them all if yep. you missed one. I think that's it. Mm -hmm. So say bye, bye. everybody. Bye.